any movie fan being in here is the stuff that dreams are made of, or nightmares, depending on how you look at it. But the good news for hardcore collectors of film memorabilia is that a lot of this is about to go to auction. Oh, I think everybody should be getting excited about this auction. It's an unprecedented opportunity to come and bid on some of the most interesting artefacts that have actually been used in films and TV shows. Among the items up for grabs are the iconic hoverboard from Back to the Future 2, valued at 14 to 18,000 pounds. Doesn't fly in real life though, just so you know. To us, Mr. Bond. Oh, uh, I prefer the 62 myself. Then the Scaramanga shirt from the man with the golden gun. He had three nipples and nine buttons, and it's estimated at around £7,000. And then there's this. So this is an original Batmobile miniature from Batman Forever. Wow. It's Val Kilmer's Batmobile. Uh, it's a special effects model miniature that was used for special effects shots. And this is coming up for auction with an estimate of twenty to £30,000. Wow, why not? A posh remote control car, basically. With a jet engine built into the back of it. The auction will take place on the 16th of October, but if you can't afford to bid for the Batmobile, you can see the items up for grabs at an exhibition at View Westfield in London. Be warned though, if you've got your eye on something, something might have its eye on you. You'd like that, wouldn't you? So I know who this is then. Where did you get him from? This guy came from Rick Baker's basement. He was the creature and makeup effects specialist on the movie. Wow, and how much do you think he might go for at auction? I think we're going to see him sell for somewhere between three and five thousand pounds. Wow. Is he dangerous? Don't let him anywhere near water. No, hang on a mo, chuck some water on him. If gremlins multiply when they're wet, imagine how much money we could make at auction with more of them. We flip trot, five news.